Curtis DeBoard from U.S. Ordnance. I'm the director of sales, and uh, this is our 7.62 machine gun uh, M240. It's an infantry model. Uh, it comes in about three other different models. One for the tanks, mm -hmm. which is the Charlie. Uh, the H is for the hotel. Okay. And, uh, also for boats. And they have another. Uh, Variant for golf that has some different accessories, uh, a little bit more lightened up. But um, okay, let's go through the basics. You know, what's the rate of the fire, which ammo it use, calibers, and all that. Great, it's 7.62 NATO. Uh, it uses M13 disintegrating length, and the rate of fire is adjustable between 650 and 950. Mm -hmm. Hey, everybody! Just a quick note. Firearms Guide is the world's largest searchable guns and ammo technical reference guide and gun values guide that presents over 80,000 antique and modern firearms, air guns, and ammo with tech specs, high-res images, features, ballistics, prices, and gun values from 100% to 30%. It has the largest professional gunsmithing library with over 23,000 printable gun manuals, schematics, parts lists, and old catalogs. See why all gunsmiths have already subscribed. So join us at firearmsguide.com. That's firearmsguide.com. Weighs 23 pounds, um, and you can convert the feet from left or right. Uh -huh. It's a gas piston block, isn't it? It's It's a gas piston, so it's not recoil. Yes, uh -huh. yes, it's gas operated. Gas operated, uh, yeah. Bottom eject. Uh -huh. It's a bottom eject. It has both uh, hydraulic uh, dampening in the buttstock, and the, the other variant is uh, compression buff. Okay, great. And I can see that you attach some dim, huge optics on it, so that can be also added on top of it? Yeah, it has a Picatinny rail on the top cover, and you can attach optics on that. It also can have uh, a Picatinny handguard. Uh -huh. uh, for attaching most commonly lasers, night vision lasers. Night vision lasers. Bipod right here as well. That's a cool looking gun. 